I have got to stop closing Discord right at the beginning. Wait, oh no. We watch, yep, we watch everything crash. Hello? There we go. <laughs> hey, there's Axe! Wait, were you summoned by Chili Cheese Fritos? Is that what brought you here? I understand if that's what brought you here, because that would bring me here too. I, I also can be summoned by Chili Cheese Fritos. Alright, so, we're trying a new game here today, something called Wall World, another part of my roguelikes collection that I picked up recently. Not expect the music to just like jump right in, so that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get myself moved. I have no idea where like the UI actually is on this game, so we'll see. All right, let's try something new together. I'm excited. I hope you are too. My grandpa once said that the wall has an edge and people used to live at the bottom of it, on the ground. He said the earth was round. Sounds crazy, right? How can one live on a ball? And how would he know about the supposed bottom of it? We've been living on the wall for several generations at least, and so far no one has found even a hint of a top or bottom. The wall stretches infinitely in all directions, and its bowels provide us with everything we need. It wouldn't be that bad, actually, if it weren't for the Xyrex. These creatures attack like clockwork, so you don't want to go too far beyond the perimeter. But sometimes we still have to make these forays, and sooner or later, the current mines are depleted. The only chance of surviving such an expedition is your Robo Spider and the Wall Digger exosuit connected to it, but even with proper equipment, not everyone returns. In fact, not even half of them do. For some reason, I increasingly want to believe that the ones who don't return have found that very edge my grandpa spoke about. Maybe his words affected me more than I thought. Maybe that's why I became a wall digger too. To find the edge of the wall. <laughs> Being indoors for this, I am already getting very warm. So it is time to start reducing layers. Although well, it seems like I'm gonna have to tie my hair back. I am cooking. Okay, that helps, but the leggings gotta go too. This is ridiculous. Why puppy overheat? Alright. We're down to just the trans flag skirt, and you know what? That's all that I need. New game, new game, new game, nor new game. Oh! 
Okay. Classified. Wait. Did I not get this? Oh, it's a $3 DLC. I'll get it. We'll add that. That's silly. Mm. Whoop. Wrong number. Alright, we'll try that later. Back to the chill vibes. And we'll get the DLC another time. <clears throat> oh, we still have that pop out. You found the entrance to the mine. Enter the mine, R, to put your Robo Spider in stationary mode and start digging. Spider stabilized. Disconnect from the spider, E, to start mining. Break rock with your plasma drill. Use the vacuum to collect res dropped resources and go back to the spider to unload. What? Already. We're playing Sideways Dome Keeper, apparently. Plus to drilling efficiency, plus to gun rotation speed, plus to machine gun fire rate. <clears throat> I apparently stripped too many layers and I'm already cold again. Thank you, body. And I've managed to unplug the phone. So, one sec, I need to put that back before the face tracking goes away. If it wasn't obvious, I am not used to streaming in this space. Usually, <laughs> I'm in a spot that I've already been working in for the last year. But it is way too cold, even with my heater running. And I am not going to fight the elements on that one. Okay. Machine guns. I'm going to go with the plasma cutter. More efficiency sounds better, means more loot.
Hey there, Nyan. How you doing, hon? Hope you had a lovely holiday. Oh, well, these ones are flying units. I have no idea what I'm doing. You can jump into the spider anytime and go along the wall and search for more promising mines. Okay. <clears throat> Good, just chilling before bed, still visiting family. I see. I was about to ask, how's, how's family doing? Eight and seven, plus to movement speed in the mine. Nice. Nice low drama holiday. Good food, no big complaints. Hell yeah! <clears throat> we had good food. I um sent one of the cat girls to go deliver more to her, to her partners elsewhere in the city. It was it was nice. Yep, there's a Luma sleeping next to me. She got a little too toasty uh, while we were medicating before stream, so she's having a nap. My mouse is not behaving. Nice and roasty toasty, I suppose so. But my mouse is really not working with me. Ow. Rude. <clears throat> oh, it's all covered in snow. That's cute. Efficiency.
Hmm. So alternative means of getting repairs. I think I want increased fire rate first. Mouse, please. It's just not detecting half the time. Oh, nice. I wonder if there's anything over here. found a breaker generator, a portable, portable seismic generator. Every 180 seconds, the spider produces a portable generator that can be placed in the mine where it will gradually destroy the blocks in its range. Ooh. Holy! Thank you. 
two very similar takes on the same idea, but I really like how different they both are. Two breakers now. Robo Spider was destroyed. <clears throat> All right. So hot in this house, old people love to make it so damn hot, honestly, like, I, I understand, uh, bodies not doing what you want them to, I wish that my body would do what I wanted to and actually thermoregulate the way I've trained it to, so, mood. So I need six to begin with.
Hey there, Katsu. How you doing, hun? Hope you had a lovely holiday. You got to eat so much delicious food. Doing pretty decent. Chilling. Hanging out with Luma. No food was home alone. Found the overdrive every 60 seconds allows you to accelerate for a short time. I mean, no reason you can't make the tasty food on your own. Nice. I guess I keep getting experience for everything that I destroy, so I may as well keep doing it.
all the loot. It's all mine now. Speed to be good. Overdrive plus a speed bonus, plus the duration, plus the cooldown speed. Hmm. Wow, that worked really well. Good to note that the uh, diagonal movement is also limited. What did I find here? You found a stake thrower. A weapon that fires stakes in a ballistic trajectory. The power of the shot depends on how long you hold the fire button. Got a new weapon, switch to it and try it out. Let's see. More damage, increased damage, but also increased charge duration, and increased draw speed. I see.
plasma drill range. Oh. Increased chance to drop. Breaker generator. Take three relics. to drilling efficiency, plus to movement speed. Probably should go for the plus to movement speed at this point. Still no greens. Close to drill range. More damage from every bolt would be great. Hmm. Or more damage on the stake thrower. Poor spider bot. I can barely handle this. Okay.
Hey, mouse. Please. I don't know why it is today that you've decided that you're going to stop reading the surface, but we've never had this issue before. I'm sitting here fighting with myself about whether or not I should go grab that breaker that I just left behind, but I don't think I'm going to survive no matter what. So I may as well go for what I can get, and I've got a hell of a laser on this exosuit now. Hey, what do you know? You found a turret replicator. It allows you to build turrets at the entrances of unoccupied mines. These turrets attack enemies automatically and require no maintenance. Turret max limit, 5. Replicators allow the spider to build a variety of structures. To do that, the spider must be connected to a mine that has no structures yet. Okay. To open the construction menu, press B. Select the icon of the object you want to build near this mine or close the construction menu if you don't have enough resources. Huh. Please. Oh, this automatic turret is nice. vehicle. It's had such a hard time. Whoa, that laser though. Alright, let's take this over this way.
I hate juggling so much. <sighs> That's a sad one. Uh, still nothing for repairs, though. Resources that turn though. All right, let's see. More vacuum cleaner. More plasma drill. Even more plasma drill. Let's do more vacuum. It honestly seems most pertinent. Uh, sure. More spider speed. Cutting speed, please. Small things.
Ow! Ow! Yeah, 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 I hear you. I'm on my way. You found a bomb! Every 180 seconds, a spider produces a bomb. You can pick it up and carry it down the mine. If you let go of it, the mine, the bomb will explode after a countdown, blasting all blocks nearby. Uh, okay. Thank you. More efficiency. What do we find? Found a stake thrower. Nice. My little crab bot.
Hell yeah. <clears throat> Feeling productive. Making some good progress. What do we get? Turts! Yeah! Build menu! Oh wait. Build menu! Hell yeah! Slaps. Three slaps? Come at me! Yo, that's so nice. That one would be nice. Let's get some more damage on there.
Was there a great flood? And isn't that proof that the wall is not infinite? Well, let me put it this way. Who told you that the wall was flooded to the very foundation? What? What? Is this a Noita reference? Uh... Alright. I am so confused. Let's go. You found a drone system. A drone that auto-targets enemies appears next to the Robo Spider. Nice. zone. We head back over this way. And then we got a nice little safe spot. With extra turrets. Whoops. No! Don't waste time. Okay. We even got a crystal for repairs if we wanted to. But I want to take a look at this drone. Minus to spread. Plus more shots in a burst. Plus to reload speed. Ooh, more drones. Okay. Please. I've wasted a third of a, a cycle here. Allow me. Pretty much everything in that spot. Reload faster. More shots more often.
It is three to repair this vehicle. Hey there, Busta. How you doing, hon? Ooh, fancy. Different material. of whatever that crystal is. Okay. I'm not, I'm not feeling like I'm gonna make it through this. What happens then? Two, one, zero? What the hell is that? What? What? Um... What the hell was that? Ahoo! <laughs> sure. Okay. We're gonna call that good for Wall World for now, and uh, change up for a different game for another one of the same sort, just vertical instead. <laughs> Let's see, go over here.
So, earlier today, I picked up the Assessor after clearing my first run. I am not good at using the Assessor, and we unlocked a additional difficulty and map size. Now, the Assessor uses a different set of mechanics for mining and special abilities. For example, pressure mining. And bolts. And gravity wells. Okay. So, the assessor. A sophisticated, sophisticated miner who employs experimental kinetic energy and gravity technology. All sorts. Reload longer to increase the power of the kinetic spheres. Oh. Directly below the dome to indicate where to shoot bundles upwards. Oh. Okay. And increase the speed of compression mining. I'm learning. So now I have multiples. Oh, all right. that work that time? Good. Oh. Love that noise. Hate these enemies.
Okay. Yeah, I am not good at the Assessor. In fact, I'm really bad at the Assessor. Oh, there's more than one there. I might have to go back to the original engineer. As much as uh, I'm enjoying this, I already did play it though for like three and a half hours earlier today. And then just did Wall World, which is, as far as I can tell, really the same game.
Well. Yep, we're dead. It was nice, but it's over. Ah! Well, I get to keep the lift at least. Ah! Okay. Gamer ADD has kicked in. Let's uh, let's do a round of peglin while we're at it, right? <laughs> Where's my music? Oh, I paused the wrong thing. I see. Wait, continue? I had a paused game? A Peglin? Since when? Yeah, this doesn't look... Uh, huh? Alright. 51 coins and short fuse to start. And a new loading symbol. That's cute. And a code and orb. Ooh. Game, you spoil me. Oh, let's turn that up. Alright. Terrible. Let's see. Hey there, Hunter. How you doing, sweetheart? It's been a minute. Very nice. Everything is scaplode. Can be upgraded any number of times. Uh, Memoir was pretty good. Just gaming? What you playing today? Pocket sand, dumbbell. Apply blind. Oof. Ball lightning, swolt orb. Susceptible. Nah, swolt orb it is. Alright. Hell yeah. Very nice. Kind of missed that one. Seriously? Oh, come on. Damage rejection slime, rub orb, susceptible. Mm. Back. What's on the map? Oh, yeah. Swolt orb. 
Upgrade. Continue. Doing some custom access maps in Left 4 Dead 2. Plus damage. Yes, plus damage. Almost. Choke mod. Choke mod. Criticus. Choke mod. <sighs> Choke mod. I'm gonna die. Slap! Yep. New game. Assault Totem. House of Slime. Grubby Gloves. Spin Faction on everything. Took no damage. But give to them everything. Oh, Bolleviation, ball lightning, and an inferno orb. Ball lightning! Yeah. So cold. I am the cold puppy. Right, this whole level is shuffled. Wow, that uh, spinfection too is something else. Warbust sounds awesome. Oh, no. Alright, well I get to go to that store at least. That is absurd watching it just kill things before it even gets to me. Hell yeah. Alright. For every 15 
Oh no, that sounds terrible. Don't want, don't want, continue. We're going to the store. I've been saving all this money. Special button. I do like it when things push my special button. I don't know. I'm, I'm a very tired dog. Percentage of health. Nice. Double damage slime to every nine hit. Offer the pebble, offer the pebble. Navigation inflation! Nice! That's a good one. That is a very nice way to equalize a lot of damage coming from these. Wow. Okay. Potion Bolt and a Critter Ball. Might deal no damage, but it'll do a lot of other things. Uh, if ever two activated, whenever you lose health, you gain two Ballusion, chance to avoid incoming attack. Whenever you lose health, deal twice that much damage to all enemies. Chance to dodge can be very, very powerful. All right. Wow, all right. Uh, what's the max health? Oh, hell yes.
<laughs> wow. Shock Absorber, Darkness, Eterball, Protect Orb, Shock Absorber. Crit some all fleece. Uh, refreshing punch turns all refresh into bomb. Uh, crit some all fleece will deal more damage in the long run and will give me the ability to take on bosses and stuff. So let's see if it's enough. I mean, we did just deal this much damage against the last enemy. Let's see, this can't do anything yet, so we'll start off with Pebble. Got him. Kritzabalus. Mm. Self damage reduced. That's pretty nice. Multi ball. Electropagnet. Kinetic meteorite. Yep. Every three hit causes it to bounce even more, creating ridiculously effective combinations later. And since slides aren't really going to be a thing for much longer, it plays well with all the other stuff. I'm so confused by what, what's happening right now. Extra bouncy. Kinetic meteorite is causing some wackiness here. Oh, I got that one through his shield. That's awesome. Slap. I can't do much at this point. There we go. Can target any massive damage on crit. Starts dealing damage. To 
the right. To the right. To the right. <laughs> Pebble. What are you? A little rainbow slime. Got away. So you get two turns to try and knock that one out, if you can see it. Two damage. You teleported. I wonder what the thing is if you end up getting that slime. No. 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 Well, that's cute. <laughs> Chaos. From seemingly nowhere, an inferno ignites. Dash through the flames. What are you doing in here? You're going to blow my cover! Please take this relic I found and get out of here. An apple. One spin faction. Slimes apply, it gets upgraded plus two. Bouncers and yeah, bouncers contribute. Mysterious trio of spirits pop out and surprise you on your journey. I think this little one could use our help, says one of the spirits. Remove ball lightning, upgrade double trouble, duplicate or bust. You peek into your satchel and see a shiny new Orbus level 3, and when you look up, the spirits have disappeared. 
Dang. Dumbbell. Heal six when reloading. Attacks get increasing damage multiplier based on the number of Okay. Rephilosopher Stone. We're doing a money build, I guess. A forge. Scoop up the whole forge. Yes, it's mine now. Can't do anything yet. This can. Due to the lack of splash damage, I have been un oh, wow, seeing that just like punch right through their own people. Ah, hey there, Rizzy. How you doing, hun? I am cold. I am a cold puppy. So cold. So cold, in fact, I might put my shirt back on. <laughs> earlier let's see here Rezzy if you're here I should probably actually consider a break because I've been uh, going for two hours run summary hmm 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 How about this? I'm gonna at least put on... Why do I smell? It smells like one of my partners just decided to uh, toast some waffles. At like... Yeah, at midnight. <laughs> Is that ambidextrary? Oh, Orbert Story. Question mark notes have an increased chance to be... Ooh. Yes. See, I didn't even know about like the there being rarity tables in this game, so this sounds awesome. Oof. Okay.
Balling. Steal splash damage to the enemies immediately to the left and right of the target. Okay. Okay. I do like Orbust. Has been useful. Wow, that's some serious damage at level 2. You find a waterfall just off the pass. Check behind the waterfall. Gain smoke mod. You find hidden treasure. You stumble onto a strange mirror. Remove all orbs. The shadows in the mirror offer to ease your burden and you accept. You feel a slight sense of dread as your satchel empties and the world fades to black around you. You awaken sometime later with a mysterious new Orboros, level one, as a sole content of your satchel. No! Ah, oh, it's all skulls now. Wow! Heals. Yes. Upgrade. Or yes. Continue. Ubu Bikilis. Hey there, Dan. How you doing, hon? Hope you're having a lovely evening.
You reach a clearing that is unusually slimy, but you progress cautiously but still lose your step. Oh. What if my only attack was, uh, vampirism? Ugh. This will make sense. I see. Missed. What a terrible run. Ah, I'm a little sleepy. I think it's from uh, games not exactly being engaging to me this evening. The roguelikes aren't being polite, and that's sometimes how it goes. Turns out Wall World is the same thing as Dome Keeper, just sideways. Like, I knew there was a similarity, but I didn't expect them to be, like, nearly identical to each other. It's pagan time. Ah. Anybody else get some fun Christmas gifts? <laughs> I'm excited to try mine out.
Don't catch pebbles. Get rid of them. No! I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. You didn't give me what I want? I don't care. We're pachinkoing this now. Yeah? Ambiguous? Ambiguous. Okay, let's go. Boss fight? No problem. Die. <laughs> Projectile attacks pierce an additional enemy. Every reload grants balance. Collected money contributes to damage. Map shop shop. Oh, it's the one device. I'm like, what is happening? Delightful. No pierce on that. to ballad. this guy. Love this guy. A friend to goblins all around. Hell yeah. How was that for a crit? Half your health in one freaking shot. The ball. Oh, hell yeah. There we go. Ha ha ha!
this is gonna be awesome. Ah, woo! Hey there, Filson. How you doing, sweetheart? I hope you got some good rest. The mute who never sleeps. Just woke up. Alright. My mute who can never sleep also stays up all night listening to, uh, well, a lot of different kind of music, actually. It's really sweet. Nice. Okay. <laughs> ah! <laughs> See what I mean? The loudest mute. Sums a round squirrel onto the pegboard whenever 30 pegs are hit, but is destroyed after 100 uses. Every 25 pegs. Well, I'm about to make it so that I always have healing. Popcorn plus Matryoshka, mat Matryoshka orb. Matryoshka. Anyways. Grants all orbs plus plus. Massive damage on crit. Hmm. You find what looks like a Haglin standing motionless on your path. Something about it gives you the creeps, but they seem to be offering the same services as usual. Consider it done. Yes, that was a good shot. Went to fourth level in Peglin for the first time. Nice. 
unknown navigation. Which will take me to a boss fight on the other side? Yeah, sure. Wait, no crit? Ah, uh, there it is. Wow. Thanks, game. Meow. Oh, it's this guy. Alright. Well, since everything requires this now. Dang. So close. On yes, good. It is so hard to get any damage across at this point. Ugh. Of course. Could we please? Run summary. I even had really good uh, relics that time, but just wow, these are all terrible. I guess ambiguous amulet. <laughs> Boss fight right at the beginning. I don't know. Maybe I'll get lucky. Find something good. Duplicates hit Y. 
What? That sounds pretty awesome. But I want the Coden Orb. <laughs> you know what? I should not have picked this fight. What a fun noise. Sounds great. Go grab food and coffee. Alright, see you later, Feltzen. Travel safe, hun. <sighs> 
Very nice. Boom. Applies healing slime to every 10 hit. Healing slime to heal one when hit can only be used once per paddle. Uh huh. Uh, duplicate all orbs, duplicate a random orb. Pebble, great. <laughs> Three crits in one throw. Slap, slap, slap. Plap, plap, plap.
jeez. Alright. Yeah, it's not happening. Okay. We are going to take a short break here. I'm going to go use the restroom and refill my water. And I will be right back in about five minutes and we'll continue on with some more gaming. Let me know what you folks would like to see in the comments. And We'll see you in just about five minutes.
I'm actually able to feel my energy drifting far enough here that even if I were to pull out another game, it wouldn't be the best gameplay. Let's go ahead and see who we want to raid over to. I'm hurting too much to uh, keep up the persona at the moment, but I will be back tomorrow evening about 9 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. I do apologize for the late start tonight. I had a lot of fun. Let's see here. Who's on? Who's doing something? Yeah, I hope I feel better too. Uh, this isn't. This isn't fun. <laughs> Uh, who's this? Somebody named... Uh-huh. Alright, you know what? Let's go ahead and raid over to Val. My usual. See you folks all soon. Love you all. Thank you very much for tuning in tonight and for all those that took part in the chat and for anybody that tunes into the VOD. Also, my apologies for anybody that misses their opportunity to check the VODs because I may have fallen a little behind on those, but we'll do what we can. It's It's been a very hectic and busy holiday. See you all soon. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Love you all. Good night.